What's up guys, I device help here, and today in this video I'm going to be sharing with you guys what's new with iOS 9 GM. Now basically this is the final version of iOS, it is the gold master copy, this is the one that will give you the best idea of what iOS 9 will be when it gets released September 16. Now I also have a video on iOS 9.1 beta 1 which Apple also released. So let's jump right into it and see what's new. First I want to cover some of the things I covered with iOS 9.1 beta 1, and that is the new Siri icon when you go through the setup process as well as the Bluetooth hands-free CarPlay so when you jump into your car if you have an Apple CarPlay enabled vehicle then you can wirelessly and enjoy your CarPlay that's also enabled with iOS 9.0 GM and with the final version of iOS 9 you do not get the new emojis that we saw with iOS 9.1 beta 1 again I have a video in the video description down below so you can take a look at the new emojis of iOS 9.1 beta 1 but we don't have them on the final version of iOS 9 that's going to be released on September 16th. However, what it's new under here, the cellular data option, you can select right here where it says voice and data. As you can see here, you have 3G, 2G, and LTE options to select. If you have a data plan that doesn't offer you a lot of data, this will help you preserve some of that data. Yeah, the speed may be decreased, but you can preserve some of that data by downgrading to 2G if needed in the future. That's also a welcome addition. If I go here into the generals tab and go to the Siri now hey Siri gets a new user interface it allows Siri to kind of get used to your voice so if someone else says hey Siri then it doesn't activate on your phone so this way Siri will learn the tone of your voice and that way you can only activate it with your voice when you say the command hey Siri now this is hands-free hopefully this will be available without having to plug your device to a power source we'll have to wait and see on that so that's basically all the changes around the operating system it is running very fluently the battery it's been working rather nicely for me I've been getting nice results with the battery as well the operating system feels ready for prime time and it will be released again september 16th this is a better idea of what to expect that day when ios 9 goes officially to the public don't forget to click that like button it's always appreciated i hope you guys enjoy the video and i will catch you guys on the next one peace